Yeah. Period titties. Period. Okay, so I just wanna come on here real quick because my camera about to die and I did not know that until I just sat down and got my shit together. Anyway, I just wanna let y'all know that I'm gonna do another photo shoot. It's gonna be a self shot photo shoot. The last photo shoot was kinda expensive, you know, just getting there, doing it, and all that stuff, finding a photographer and finding the clothes real quick and all that, but it was worth it because it was my birthday and I didn't want anything wrong. But this time, I'm gonna do my own photo shoot because I don't want to deal with the whole process of finding somebody with a creative eye. You know what I'm saying? Getting comfortable, meeting them, meeting up, and all of that stuff. I just want to do it my fucking self. And I can do it myself, so that's what I'm going to do. And I haven't got anything together, no idea, no concept, no place, no time, no anything. But all I know is when I do this intro, I always end up following through. When I do a snap, when I do a YouTube video or anything. So now that I have started this YouTube video, it's already done. So it's gonna be a self shot, seven times out of 10 indoors. I move out next week, so, and I have a new apartment. And I can actually show y'all me decorating my room and get my photo area together and get my painting area together. So I got shit, I got shit to do. This is the beginning. Yeah, I'm gonna do my own hair. Nine times out of 10, those ginger locks. Stay tuned. The Ginger Locks video will probably be out before these, just like the Bohemian Braid video. I think, I, cause I like the whole format of how I did that. You know what I'm saying? Get ready for a shoot, content within content. You know what I'm saying? When I'm trying to think about how I'm gonna do my roots, like, are my roots gonna stay black? Cause if my roots stay in black, it's gonna kind of kill the vibe for me. I want it to be bold, drastic. You know what I'm saying? It's not bold, drastic if you can tell. That it's, you know, not my hair. Like, I want it to be a drastic difference. Like, a drastic difference, but still real. You know what I'm saying? But when I put weave in my hair, I try to be as natural as possible. Because I be like, the weave is cute and all, but wearing your real hair is just a flex. So, when I, wear my, when I wear a weave, I try to just flex in other real places. You know what I'm saying? So, that's what I'm going to try to do. Still holistic still natural you know what i'm saying i really feel like i'm talking to y'all because when i talk out loud it's like the ideas just get to flowing let me make sure i'm focused before i get mad so i really can't tell my camera screen if it's super focused or not i really be feeling like i want my shit to be perfect like i want my shit to look crispy like l recording it all right y'all i'll see y'all i got my conditioner and my oil and water together try to moisturize my hair every day sorry i'm gonna try to moisturize my hair every day so i got my leave-in my water my oil this leave-in is shea moisture honey and yogurt hydrate and repair multi-action leave-in anyway i just kind of tell y'all usually when i do photo shoots i do a little you know what i'm saying behind the scenes kind of video kind of like a music video kind of vibe but i'm not singing or dancing or nothing i'm just really just being at the photo shoot feeling myself it always turned out real cute and i like doing it because it makes it, it show like the recent music that i've been listening to and how you know what i'm saying how it made me feel and stuff so um for this photo shoot i know i said i wanted ginger hair and stuff and i wanted to keep it kind of natural i'm trying to make it as natural as possible so i still got my same little vibe and music last time i used ari lenix um fuck is the name of that song outside outside by ari lenix on her new album uh point of view i'm pretty sure that's wrong but off a new album, I used that song and I loved it. I loved how the video came out. There you go. If you want to see the rest of it, then go to my Instagram at carver.girl. Oh, carver.girl is my Snapchat. Car underscore girl with two L's is my um, 
Instagram if y'all want to go see that video. It's really nice. I like it. It's not that long. It's just to show my little editing skills and shit and my modeling skills a little bit. Yeah, I just want to come and show up and tell y'all what song I think I'm going to use this time. And I think it's going to be Manny Wells. I just found him. But I really feel like he's about to be a motherfucking goat in the R&B industry <laughs> whenever y'all discover him. So I'm about to help him out. And y'all can hear a little bit of why he going to be in my thing. I just love this song, y'all. I just love it. I'm going to try not to get copyrighted. So let me just... Wait, 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 because you got to hear it. You got to hear him come in. Hold on. Please don't die, camera. Just listen, listen, listen. Y'all, it just put me in the world to just to be that girl. Hold on, wait, hold on, wait, because somebody called me. Hold on, wait, hold on, hey. Y'all, this song goes so hard to me. But anyway, that's the song I'm going to use for the video. I, that's what I want to use for the video. But if it don't match the vibe, then I got to switch it up. But I just had to come tell y'all that y'all need to go check out Manny fucking Wells right now. Because that's not the only song that's a motherfucking vibe. So yesterday, I showed y'all the song I wanted to use. It just mean you Manny Wells. Don't get to check him out. I decided that I'm going to do the shoot in May. Yeah, I'm going to do the actual shoot in May. If it's indoors, it's going to be in May. If I don't find nothing outdoors, yeah, it's going to be indoors. But I'm still looking for an outdoor, air, an outdoor place to do it because the dilemma is I want to do my hair right now. Okay. I want to do my hair right now, but I want to wear my real hair to the International Festival in Louisiana. So, Saturday, I'm, I mean Monday, y'all. Oh my God. I'm moving out of my um, first apartment. And it's very sweet because this apartment is really ass when it comes to maintenance. It's very, very expensive. It's very nice. I love it. I love it. But... And I love my little setup that I got here in my bathroom. But um, since I moved here, I didn't, I just got a bigger family now. No kids or nothing. And we got pets and it's just too, it's too much. So it's very sweet leaving my apartment. But I'm hoping for a better like overall quality of life because the rent went down in the next place but it's still a two bedroom and i mean it's a two bedroom this is a one bedroom but because it's a one bedroom and it's expensive i got a big bathroom i got a big my room not huge but i got a big kitchen and everything and then in the new place it's gonna be a smaller kitchen it's going to be a smaller situation. I'm really looking forward to the smaller kitchen, of course, even though I don't really film in my kitchen or nothing. But I like how the space I have in there. But anyway, I remiss too much. Uh, so yeah, I'm in the process of moving out. So I don't want to take it down to after this weekend. After this weekend, I think it's one week until... Anyway, yeah, I'm about to go look for photo shoot ideas because obviously... I'm right here right now. I'm feeling a little photo shoot ideas. Doing my hair next week. This friend, trying to see where I need to stand it. Trying to see where I need to stand it. I did a test run, but I'm not sure if. You know, I'm not sure. But I know you can see me. So that's the number one thing. Because 
right now as you can see my kitchen is different and smaller unfortunately but uh, we finally moved into the new place which is way bigger than the last place so I guess sacrificing a little kitchen space didn't hurt nothing because my room y'all his room bathrooms too like oh anyway so today it's the day that I start really filming for this next photo shoot and I know I know I know I'm late as fuck today I'm just gonna be making one of those acai bowls I don't have acai or a lot of stuff that's in the actual bowl that I buy but um, I've been trying to save money and do some healthier eating choices at the same time so um, I usually get this acai bowl early in the morning so acai peanut butter bowl with peanut butter, strawberries, bananas, uh, dates, um, almond milk, and pea protein because y'all know I be in the gym. That's where I just came from, girl. My hair look a fucking mess. So we're going to be going to get the hair today to do my hair. Right now I'm about to show y'all how to make these acai bowls. I'm just going to say a smoothie bowl. I'm going to bring y'all closer in a minute. But with this bowl, I know y'all have seen smoothie bowls before, so I'm not finna act like y'all don't know. My little bitty, not much blender. Basically, you just put fruit in the blender and then you uh, cut fruit up on top with some granola. Let me see if I got some granola. Oh, and I don't have agave, so I'm gonna be using honey. Here's the peanut butter. I got some almonds, so you know, we're gonna have some kind of crunch here. Don't talk about it. I'm not playing. Don't talk about it. Don't talk about it. Worry about your mama house, girl. Worry about your mama house. For later when I do my deep conditioning and things. So we got this yogurt. We got this mix. We don't have this. We don't need this. Peanut butter. We have this banana because... We only need half of the banana for the inside. Okay, you see what I'm saying? It wasn't even all that. Like, you're just doing too much. Oh, and dates. 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 Yes, I have dates. Like real colorful, real scrumptious. It's that is it. Almond milk. I forgot I need to add greens in my diet. So why not? They don't do this at the restaurant. They don't put the they don't put spinach in it at the restaurant. I'm just trying to get all the nutrients I can get. Girl. Like look at that. Look at that. Okay, I added the milk on Snapchat because Snapchat really didn't get no content just then because I was worried about y'all. So we got the strawberries and the banana and that's what we put on top and we got almonds and we got honey. Okay. Alright, yes I have a cutting board. I just need to hurry up and get done. And then I'm just gonna put honey because I don't have no acai. I mean, I don't have no agave. So I'm just gonna put honey on top. Oh! Please! Please don't play with me, y'all. Go make your own bowl. Okay. This shit was cheap. Frozen fruit is a dollar. What make me extra dumb 
Why the fuck didn't I make this beautiful in a bowl? Since I'm sitting at the house, eating it on camera. I put this shit in here like I was finna go. 10 out of motherfucking 10. I just left Walmart. I just said I'm just gonna get the oil for today because I was supposed to get everything for my hair today. I just don't wanna take out the camera for no reason because I don't even think I'm gonna be able to do the treatment tonight. And as you can see, my hair is in desperate need of a treatment. Like you can see, it's sad. But anyway, so I got the go-to, the number one, the OG coconut oil. Uh, I watched this other girl's um, hot oil treatment. I think I want to do a hot oil treatment as well as a deep conditioner. I'm going to do the deep conditioning. Wash it. And then the next day I'm going to do the oil treatment. I already got a deep conditioner at the house. But I'm, I, I want to get something like organic. Like I want to get raw ingredients. Like now how I got all these oils. Um, I got jojoba. Oh, it's leaking. I got jojoba oil. Yeah, I know. Another OG. For the scalp, hydrates hair. Anti frizz, all that. But you know, we need an actual moisturizer. Word to my mama, because that's what she found me. And I also got this vegetable based glycerin. And this girl on YouTube said that glycerin att attracts moisture out the air. So we're going to get this because I can't. I, I done got in the routine of spraying my hair every day. So I, I do have a daily routine, nightly, morning, everything. But I just wanted to penetrate my hair. Like, I just wanted to sit in there. The only oil I got right now is avocado oil. Or is it almond oil? I don't know. One of them. And I don't really know the benefits for that to your hair. I just got some oil that day and I just use it. I should do the deep condition before I do the oil treatment, right? So, I can't do anything. Anyway, yeah. I'm going to try to get my deep conditioner tomorrow. Hopefully, I'm done before 7 so I can go ahead and get everything I need. I probably won't get the hair tomorrow. Depending on how much the deep conditioner costs. Because this right here was kind of cheap. This was just like $13 altogether. But anyway... Yeah, that's y'all's update. Bye. Okay, y'all, I'm on my last order of the day, and it is 521. I should have time to go to the hair store today. But I think I'm just going to get my deep conditioner. <laughs> I know I keep switching it up, y'all. I know, I, know, I know, but in your perspective, it's really going by fast as fuck. If the conditioner not stupid high, because I really want something really, 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 really good. But if it's not stupid high, then I'll get the hair too. But we'll see. Well, right now, what we're trying to choose between my mama um, recommended some, and you know, my mama is like a natural hair guru. I know you don't know, but I'm telling you. She recommended the mayonnaise uh, leave in. I think it looks like this. She recommended some other ones, but this one stuck out because it says mayonnaise. And um, I see her using it. I like I she, she keeps it, so it gotta be good. So I'm gonna get that. I'ma still add some stuff in there, probably like uh, some honey, some aloe vera. I got some aloe, aloe vera, and I, I just need to make sure it don't like react wrong, cause I just be feeling like I don't know what's in them hair products. That's why I really want to make my own shit, but I'm trying to be, you know. After I get the hair, then everything else is gonna fall into place because I just get a vibe when my hair is the same way, and I feel like when I put this weave in, it's gonna like really. Shield my hair from this hot ass sun, this direct ass sun, and I'm gonna leave it up for as long as I can because y'all know I don't really do weave, but I'm gonna try to keep it up for at least like two weeks, at least, and um, a month at the most, but I doubt it. This gas is 288. I'm about to stop. All right, see y'all at the hair store. Bye. I was looking for the original deep conditioner, but they only got the olive oil one, and I'm not trying to get that. So I'm gonna keep looking. I found it. I was overlooking it. I don't know, no, no, cause this one is kind of red. This one is one, wait, this one is copper. Oh, 30, I think it's 30. Yeah, I think it's 30, that's only $7. I'm gonna go ahead and get it before somebody else do two things. I probably need three, but I'm making them kind of big. It's not gonna be per log or anything. 
I'm gonna get three. <laughs> oh, oh, this expression and free. I don't like this one. The free treads, no. Don't get that. Okay, so I did not get the locks. Like I, um, not supposed to, but I really didn't plan on getting the locks today because I made a good amount today and I didn't make over my goal or anything, but I just felt like I'm in a hair store and they was running out, so why not go ahead and get what I needed? I'm just gonna go back and get the locks. Um, my total was $31. Let me just say that I really hate that they running out of this hair because they just say that a lot of hoes got it. And I just don't want to look like a lot of hoes. And that's just how I be feeling. Like, that's why I don't be wanting weave in my hair anyway. Like, I just want to look like Jakara. I, I might be being a little ridiculous, but I'm not. Because it's like, everybody be having the same hair. And I just don't want to look like everybody else. And that's just my dilemma right now. Like, I just don't want to look like everybody else. But, I'm just going to go ahead and do it. And try to make it as unique as possible. Try to. Try to. And, um, switch it up for my hair. It's really for my hair. This is really for my hair because she needs a break. She be, the sun just be killing it. But, um, it looked way more moisturized today because I sprayed it this morning. But, um, yeah, I just don't be wanting to look like everybody. And the fact that they running out just showed me that everybody got the shit. But I'm just going to chill and just focus on me because that's all I need to worry about because the bitches ain't gonna look like Jagara. God, I'm just playing y'all. I really hate that cocky shit, but at the same time, I just want to say that I don't want to look like everybody. I don't want to look like Jagara. I didn't change my hair. I didn't change my hair in the gym. It fell, of course. But uh, it's a cloudy day outside, so I assume that the sun won't be as harsh today. I'm still gonna try to make it stay up in this scarf. I'm not gonna change the scarf. Like I thought I was. Y'all, I'm tired. Like, in the best of ways. I feel like I could do any fucking thing. And that's why I love going to the gym. Oh, it's still wet. It still feels great. It still got like a little... Um, you can feel the moisture. When I do my hot oil treatment tonight. I already got all the oil. So, no if, ands, or buts. We're doing it tonight. And then tomorrow, after orders, we'll do the actual hairstyle. Finally. To y'all, it ain't final. Like I said, this is an easy, quick process in y'all lives. But it been three weeks. <laughs> it been it been four weeks. It been four weeks. Because I, I had to move and everything. I told y'all all this. Like, why am I still? Anyway, bye. I look a hot ass mess and it's hot as fuck. I'm about to go get my hair. I realized that I got all the transitions to when I was doing something. Um, the vlog part and the actual doing it part is on my other video, so make sure y'all go check that out. Oh, we just just don't look at me too close. I got heat rash. They got some that's 28 inches, but they don't have nothing in this color. These are 28, that one's 20. I guess I have to put something together because I don't see none. I got red. Maybe I need to look behind something. The ginger hair is selling out. That's why I don't even want it no more. Okay, so I got all the clothes that match the aesthetic on the bed. I'm gonna do a bodega style. My sister says so I'm not a bodega, so I guess that's what it's called. But I want to look like a breath of fresh air. So I got all my little earth tones and flowy clothes right here. And we're gonna go to a bookstore. Don't mind, Marco. We're gonna go to a bookstore and we're gonna 
you 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 know the vibe. Y'all done seen this vibe before. Dressed is like a breath of fresh air, just casually strolling. That's the thing. I just took a shower. I don't know how I'm wearing my hair yet. I got a limited amount of time. The bookstore closes at 8. It's 619. I didn't even know I was gonna do the shoot today, y'all. I didn't even know I was gonna do the shoot today, but I was like, my boyfriend was like, we should do it today. Oh yeah, my boyfriend is my photographer. So, uh, yeah, he was like, we should do it today. So we're going to have to rush tomorrow. And I completely agree. Um, my camera is charging. That's why I'm using my phone, by the way. And not that it's any of your business. Not that it's even causing a problem. Not that you can't see me. Not that you... But, yeah, right now I just got out of the shower. I'm about to put my outfit together the best way I can out of what I... I might add jeans, maybe, if I need to. I might add a jacket, maybe, if I need to. But right now I'm focused on putting the fit together. Let me get out that mirror. Before y'all see something that you never thought you'd see. Uh, oh, I'm taking my hair down tomorrow because I see hair follicles right here. <laughs> I see hair follicles right here like it's snatching my hair from the root. And we can't have that. So that's why I want to hurry up and do the photo shoot and get it over with. So I can take my hair down. So yeah, I got a lot of options. I got a lot to do. I got a lot of decisions to make. And I'll see y'all when I make them. Dark chocolate. Okay, so I'm kind of, sort of, not really, but kind of feeling this just because it's so flowy. But I don't know, maybe I should put this on. It got a little gray in it, a little blackness. I don't know. Then if I want to give her, I could do this. Okay, now this is giving something. I don't know what. It's giving something. <sighs> the dress is definitely giving body. No questions. The room is giving filth. Mind your business. Yeah, when I say I got seconds, I don't have seconds to spare. And Davian is taking his precious little time, apparently. Um, okay, so they close at 8. And it is 7. I don't know. It's 7. 19. And it's like 13 minutes away or something like that. I don't know. But 17 minutes or something like that. So we're going to make it at like 7.40, which is terrible. But I'm going to try to get at least like one or two pictures, y'all. One or two pictures. I ain't do this for shit. I'm taking my hair down tomorrow for sure. I'm not playing. I I know it's not I'm, it's not no questions. This is it. So we're at half price books. Barely made it. It's seven twenty six. I don't know. We got like or, or we got twenty six minutes. One or the other. I forgot. Twenty minutes. It looks like the perfect environment. I thought they had vinyls. I guess not. I don't know. I don't want to see the fit. I'm gonna leave this up for some time. See y'all when that thing came in. Y'all, I already scanned through my pictures, so I know I like them. Uh, Davian did a good job. I, I asked one of the employees to take my picture, too, and he did a good job, too. And it was he didn't even know what button to press, but he's focused it and got it together. And we, got, we came out with, like, two minutes to spare. So that's good. I really thought we was not going to get it, but I got a lot of good pictures, so I feel like I'm going to have too many to where I gotta make a decision, but that's good. But yeah, y'all, thank y'all for watching. I hope y'all enjoyed. If y'all got any more like recommendations of where and where and how and whatever, I should take a picture and leave it in the comments. Um, don't forget to rate and subscribe if you wanna see more.